Drew's Tunes, where we're going to sit down and discuss culture, basketball, and music, obviously. LaRue, I'll start with you. What was the first record, tape, CD, download, whatever it might be? I'm going to ask all you guys that. But LaRue, um, the first that you actually bought with your own money. Uh, back in the day in 1968 here in Loyola, I finally got a car. It was all BM, BMW. No, a Volkswagen. I used to get laughed about it because it was a three-seater. <laughs> I had the guy move the track out, move the seat back. It was going to be a good fit. I used to have flowers in my car at the time, too. And, uh, I was crazy about war back in the time. Janis Joplin, Jimi Hendrix. Okay. So I had a whole little A-track in the car at the time. There you go. I was a hippie. I had the uh, <laughs> <laughs> The fro. Yeah. I still got the tattoo in which I still have. Okay. The little yin yang yin 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 sign. Take it easy, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that was some good fun time. As a matter of fact, war came here in 1968 and gave us a free company of my old back in the day. We're getting... The, all the history lessons from OG today. I love yeah. it. OG. Um, yes, sir. All right, Keith, what you got, man? <laughs> I got to go a little way in again. First okay. uh, album I ever bought was the Carter Three. Okay. That's like 2006. I was with my brother, like six years old. He put me on. And that, that's the only thing I listened to for like months straight. Right. Yeah. That's a classic album. Classic. It's one crazy. All the time. Yeah. yeah. All right, Craig. Uh, I'm a big Michael Jackson guy. You know, I. Find me singing Michael Jackson at, at many points in my loyal career. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if it was. I can attest to that. <laughs> it, uh, it was actually Jackson Five, oh, uh, okay. like their greatest hits, Jackson Five, mm-hmm. and then Michael Jackson's greatest hits. It's probably the first thing I, I bought on my my iPod Touch back in the day. iPod <laughs> Touch. <laughs> All right, Benny, what you got? Uh, well, there was a, a Disney Channel show that I was a fan of. It's called Austin and Alley. And there's this guy, <laughs> no, no, well, Ross Lynch. And he had like this family band going on called R5, and they had this album, and I forgot what it was called, but uh, it was really good, and that was the first one I remember. There you go. All right, JQ. I'm not gonna lie, the only one I can remember, like, thinking of when I was that young was like Kids Bob. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting my mom's SUV, just she already knew like what I wanted on, I just put the CD in and started talking. <laughs> so it'd be like some type of Kids Bob CD. Kids for sure. How about that? <laughs> so I have a one year old, and I'm like trying to like, I catch myself. She loves her favorite TV shows, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Oh yeah, that's, that's a big. It's got some tunes. It's got some tunes. It's, it's got some tunes, and I catch myself throughout the day just hearing some of those songs. Man, I catch myself. But.